Now, the Catholic Church, Justice Development and Peace Caritas and Cardinal Adelsis has donated a sum of 3.5 million naira in food items and relief materials to victims of bandit attacks in Adamadise village, Cardinal State. The donation aims to restore livelihoods, rebuild community confidence and ensure security for the state and nation. When the challenge of food we have in this country, and this is an agrarian community, they live by farming, and the food they, they, produce, they don't only eat here, they supply. A lot of us living in Kaduna and other places, we depend on these people here. And that they, have, they are resolved, they have taken a decision to stay here. I think it's something that government should do everything and anything possible to ensure that this community is assisted to stay here and to, to look after themselves and their assisted to simply do that. We are challenging them to live up to their um, promises that they will make this country better. Mm -hmm. There's no, nobody has any excuse to leave this country worse than you, you, you met it. You promise Nigerians that you're going to make it better. Now, Reverend Father Joshua Archer, JDC, uh, PC coordinator, urges the community to provide food, clothing, and livelihood sources with shelter being the primary concern and calls for rescue efforts. The people are in the basic, uh, in basic need of certain um, uh, food items and even non-food items. That is why we have come to help pushing their challenges. So we brought items like rice, beans, um, dairy. Uh, we even brought um, uh, oil, we brought clothes, you know, and even a bundle of zinc to help them to be able uh, to recover from what they have lost. These people have made their own uh, commitment and have decided that they will stay, come what may. Ours is to support them and to call on the government to please give them the needed security. Now, victims alongside beneficiaries uh, have called on the government to ensure the communities have adequate security to return to their farms, while the residents of Adama Duse community remain hopeful that these challenges will be resolved soon. Happy to see what they're doing for us because we are ready to meet many things to help ourselves to continue to stay for here for this, for this place. Our government to assist us for this place because uh, the insecurities uh, is not uh, fine for, the, for our place here. So we are begging for uh, local government or state government to continue to assist us for this place. Six o'clock by then. We just wake and we never pray by that time. They start just enter, start shooting anyhow. We start running. We just meet them. They take us. So they went to one house here, yeah. carry people, enter another house, carry people. From there, so and um, uh, army people just enter by then. They start shooting anyhow. They come with us. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.